one of the allegations by the Indian media is that Zakir encourages suicide bombing. One Indian news channel went to the extent of saying that Zakir says let's have suicide bombing and he is a crazy fanatic. Now, where do they get this information from? I don't know. Yes, there were a few occasions, there were questions asked that what does Islam have to say about suicide bombing? And almost all the times I made it very clear that as far as Islam is concerned, suicide bombing used for terrorist attacks and killing innocent human beings is totally prohibited in the Quran. As far as suicide bombing is concerned, most of the Islamic scholars, including Sheikh bin Baz, including Sheikh Utaymi, they say that suicide bombing in all cases is prohibited. But there are some scholars, like Sheikh Safar al-Hawali, who say that if suicide bombing is used as a strategy of war, it is permitted. I will give you the views of both these groups of scholars. And Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Maidah, chapter number 5, verse number 32, that if anyone kills any other human being, unless it be for murder or for spreading corruption in the land, it is as though he has killed the whole of humanity. I make it very evident that suicide bombing used for killing any innocent human being for any terrorist attack is private in Islam. But I also went on to say some of the times, not all the times, that if it is used as a strategy of war with the permission of the army chief, it can be permitted. And we know that suicide bombing has been used as a strategy in war. We know that even in Japan, in the World War II, Japan had the kamikaze pilots who did suicide bombing. And as far as suicide bombing is concerned, if you read the book by Robert Pape, who is an associate professor in the University of Chicago, he wrote a book by the name of Dying to Win. And he is a specialist in terrorist attacks and in suicide bombing. And he says that the first time that suicide bombing became infamous was when Ignity Greenwoods, he did the first suicide bombing on 13th of March 1881. You are the first person who did suicide bombing and became infamous for that. In the last century, the first time suicide bombing was done, according to Robert Pape, was by LTTE, that's the Liberation Tamil Tigers, LM, also known as Black Tigers, and it was a Hindu organization. They were LTT. But it would be foolish for me to say that Hinduism encourages suicide bombing. And we know lately, in the last couple of decades, we hear that suicide bombing have been done by Muslims, etc. And Robert Pape says that never ever have Muslims been heard of doing suicide bombing until America occupied Iraq. And he says that all the suicide bombing that were done, it was not because of religion, it was mainly a political act because they were against certain government. So if you read the experts, you'll come to know. As far as I'm concerned, I'm totally against suicide bombing where innocent people are killed. It is against Islam and it is the second major sin in Islam. Killing any innocent human being is the second major sin in Islam. Please don't pick up some statements of mine out of context and misquote me and give a wrong impression about my views.